Uh, it's going good. Learning process. Trying to get everything I'm saying into one. Where do you think you still need to improve at? If the spring's kind of winding down, have a chance to evaluate what you think you've done, where you think you need to make some more progress this summer? Uh, I'm just getting used to the speed uh, and the plays and getting everything down back to where I was just, there's just no thinking about just going. Are there any similarities between this offense and Washington's? No similarities. This offense is way faster. What's, what's it like competing with these wideouts, even with Laquan out and some guys being injured? Two more, you know, big freshmen in this summer, does it seem like? You gotta go at all every day. What's the competition been like? Uh, I mean, it's great competition. It's, it's a room for the great like receivers. So I mean, every day we push each other to uh, to get better, and we get on each other when we make mistakes. So I mean, it's, it's a good room to be in because we all compete. When you look around that position group, position group, and meeting room with all the talent there, how good do you think that you know wide receiver group can be next year? Uh, I feel like we have the potential to be really good. Coach Hurt pushes us every day. We push ourselves. So I mean, just I look forward to to, to looking and see what we have. How difficult was it for you last year to have to sit out and go through a year of practice without getting to play? Um, it wasn't that difficult. I mean, I got to sit out and see what what I'm looking forward to and get my mind right and stuff like that. So it was a pretty good year to sit out. Who's kind of been your mentor in that room besides Grant? Uh, I would say Laquan. He's a great leader in that room for us. He's been there. He knows what he's doing. So he he puts us in the right path. You know where we're going. You've been, as, you've been as consistent as you want to be this spring? I wouldn't say it's consistent. I have some room for improvement. But, um, yeah, was, that's pretty much I, I have some room for, for improvement. What's the biggest area you have to get better at? Uh, route running, catching the ball, just doing little things. Coach Reese kind of said consistency could be the next step you take. You feel mm -hmm. like this spring you've kind of had some, some ups and downs, some good days, some bad days? I've had some ups and downs with consistency. So, but uh, in the future, that's, that's one of my things that I'm – Focusing on just consistency and uh, just getting getting right. How do you do that? How do you go about doing that? I'm sorry. Um, just focus. Just a little more focus and paying attention to detail. Is that is it? I guess harder to do or easier to do with the depth that is at wide receiver, knowing you guys have to perform each day or you could possibly lose a job. Um, I don't think it has a lot to do with that. It's just just knowing that. I mean, you're going out there every day. You just have to just have to be mentally strong for that. What do you consider your strengths as a receiver? Um, I, don't, I wouldn't say straight. I'm just I'm, I'm a good receiver. I do what I can. <laughs> I mean, you break tackles. You're a pretty powerful pretty guy. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm a physical receiver. Um, I'll say that probably probably my strength. Physicality is my strength. I know you haven't played against SEC defenses except for the one here, but from what you saw, what how how much of an adjustment will you have to go from playing Pac-12 to here? Was it at the, to SEC? Was there a lot of differences? Um, I mean, you just got to be physical. I mean. Football's football. Anywhere you go, you gotta play at your best ability. You gotta do everything right. So I mean, it's, it's faster, it's physical, but at the end of the day, it's still football. You gotta do what you gotta do. What has that competition been like in the wide receiver room? Is it pretty friendly or? Um, it's friendly, but at the same time, you know you gotta compete because you got the guy right ready to step in and, at any time. So I mean, we keep each other encouraged. That's I mean that's what we do because but we look at it as brothers. So we go in there, we we tell you you need to do this right, and then. I mean, you just slap on the back for everything you do good. So it's just positive vibes. You think that's helped you improve this spring? Because, you know, you really can't take a playoff because there are so many bodies, so much talent there. Definitely. Definitely is a drive because you know you can't take a playoff. And then it's helpful at the same time you have that person right next to you tell you when you mess up and it's going to get on your back when you when you mess up and stuff like that. So that's good. What's it been like going against a couple big physical corners kind of like yourself and, and Tony and T? Oh, we, I mean, we have some great some great corners. It's great to compete with them guys because they're, they're so good and so Enthusiastic about what they do, so I mean, it's great to compete with the guys every day. What's your uh, What's your goal for the season? Personally, um, just play my best ability, do whatever I can to help the team.